can you can you hear that? Three, two, one. Buto ni run. Ready? Three, two, one. What on earth is that? So pop da ko yawan ko eh. Hi, welcome to Cebu Bike Bootcamp and this time we will be fixing Manito R7 Pro. The damper is not working properly and there's a leakage in air spring. So this time we will be using the air pump, some sort to catch the oil. One thing to take note is this 5 weight suspension oil and the semi bath 10W40. Since this one has defective air canister, so I use safety glasses. So unlike my previous video, that's only a lower leg service, this time this will be a full service. So we will service the damper and we will service the airspeed. Air pressure, can you hear this? So look at the air pressure. It's can you can you hear that? Look at that. So let's try to let the air out slowly so that this will not turn into a projectile. But I'm wearing a safety glass now. So remove it slowly. Can you hear the hissing sound of the air? Okay, it's removed and we're Okay, three, two, one. Buto ni run. Hi, salamat. Ku, buya ni mung tinidor ngay, binu ang mning ay. You're wrong. Just you know. This one is eight mm. Instead of counterclockwise, we'll do clockwise. Ready? Three, two. So this will push inside this casting or the lower leg. Okay, remove this. There it is. Can you see it? It's completely inside. So instead of counterclockwise, use clockwise. Ready? 3, 2, 1. What on earth is that? It's that water? Nga no na ni too big. Amawa ni. So as usual, we have this damaged tension. Ika pa'y magbidyo, ika pa'y maglimpyo. Asam tam ngita, na. Look at the Teflon coating. It's being removed. So make sure to service your fork. That yellow thing there is the Teflon coating of the bushing. The inside, the Teflon coating has been also removed. So as you can see, the owner said it's been serviced. And the one that serviced this use thick grease. Thick grease really attracts sand. Look at that. It's damaged. Okay, let's remove this. Okay. Slowly but surely. So, pop! Sorry guys, but I have to do off camera on this. Remove the damper. Let's check the oil. It doesn't have any more oil because of the leakage. So we'll replace this with. Oh, there's no more oil. Look at that. So let's remove the lower part with damper. Let's just check the status of the components inside. Oops, there it is. Oil plus water. So how come? Okay, what is your Okay, I think we're all good. We just 
need to clean this and replace this with fork oil. Barong dia, sam ni sura ni magkamera tanya magto to tay. Ako na lang kani ko ano no. Let that. Ah, maklaro na eh. Basta nga mawakasa di ani eh. So I'm gonna charge bangay ngay with Okay, I think we're 3 foot. Let's take a break. We have a construction going on outside. It's not sinolog you're hearing, but a construction. So let's put some grease to the o ring. Close this tight. You will remove that grease because that one attracts the dust. Okay, we're done. Wipe the grease and then check if there's a leak. Yeah, Is there a leak? Look at that. There's a leak. <laughs> so that's it. Now we have to fix the air. So we fixed the uh, the leaking damper. There is no leak anymore. So we'll try to fix the the leaking air. Thirty minutes have passed. Solvents have been dried. Only the wax is left. This one is longer, and this one is shorter. The spring side, both fifty psi. Spring side extends fifty psi. This back. So let's or lock okay to prevent from cross threading you should use your hand first then after which use your wrench so sorry if i have done something off cam it's part of my trade secret the teflon are damaged and the o-rings are damaged so this is uh, very hard leaking damper so it's dripping oil so we fixed that and I did it off cam because it's my trade secret and I can't really teach how you guys deduce or diagnose things from one mechanic to another so it's your discarte or your way of how to deduce or diagnose things so I can't teach it so I did it off cam. Now we fixed the air issue and there's some sort of things that I can explain because if I will explain I will don't have any more money because you guys will do it yourself or DIY or DIY. <laughs> so shout out to Tropang 430 from Jinsan so yung cousin ko si Apple Alier. Shout out Erich Albaran for this fork oil and also this Simi Bath. No? Shout out Do It Paint Philippines for being my sponsor so this one is the doi chain loop to lubricate the stanchion it doesn't harm the rubber or the last wiper this one is the degreaser so this has been Mark Anthony Rakal, code name Cororo, your dear sergeant here at Cebu Bike Bootcamp remember to ride fast, one must ride slow and always service your fork so that the stanchion will not damage or the teflon coating on the bushings upper and lower will not be damaged and also I will have a lot of money <laughs> this one is full service that would be 700 and lower leg is 350 also i seldom accept clients so don't patronize me <laughs> so see you guys next video buakau trail but this one will be released before buakau trail comment on the comment section below if you know what i mean when to ride fast one must ride slow or i will discuss it in the near future it's a trivia